In vitro fertilization is commonly used to overcome the conditions, uh, endometriosis and or even uh, polycystic ovarian syndrome. But in the case of endometriosis, let's say, we know that in fact if the fallopian tubes are damaged or obstructed or if there is significant adhesions or scar tissue within the female pelvis, simply by going in and harvesting the eggs taking them away from that quote-unquote inhospitable or hostile environment, fertilizing the eggs in the laboratory, culturing the eggs, now embryos, and bypassing, again, that quote-unquote hostile environment and placing embryos directly into the uterine cavity can significantly increase the chances of conception, pregnancy, and a baby. However, we also do know that women who have endometriosis, it lowers their natural chance of getting pregnant, it lowers their chance of insemination and ovulation induction pregnancy rates, but even in vitro fertilization is not, is not perfect treatment for women that have endometriosis. It does, in fact, still have a slightly lower chance compared to women that do not have endometriosis.